three, two. Hey everybody, this is Biddy's Kettle Corn here. I'm gonna do a new flavor today. Today is gonna to be called Sweet Cheese. And um, some people have asked me, do you throw the shake on flavors in the actual bowl or do you throw them on afterwards? With the savory flavors, I actually shake them on afterwards. And here, only thing that goes in here is sugar and salt. The next question is, is that I had is from somebody on YouTube is that how do I keep it from burning? The trick is, is that once the heat goes actually up into the bowl, as long as I use my lucky paddle here and I keep stirring and I have the flame going, as long as I keep stirring, the, the popcorn will not burn. So today we're going to do sweet cheese and we're going to do uh, kettle corn with actually cheese. I'm mixing it and I'll show you how to make it today. So we're going to do sweet cheese here and we're going to get it started. I got the bowl ready. Um, on a hot day, it takes a little bit less time for the kettle corn to be ready. And then um, I'll show you how to mix it in the bowl with the sweet, with the sweet cheddar. And then that way I call it sweet cheese. I know there's other names for it, but I think sweet cheese is a pretty catchy name for it. So we'll get going, guys. All right, so now we're gonna dump it into this uh, food safe bowl here, or the uh, bucket, and we're gonna make sweet cheese now. We're gonna dump the kettle. We're not gonna put any salt on it because 
The cheese uh, flavoring already has enough salt on it, and pretty much you're gonna make mix it to taste. I mean, if you want to add less or you want to add more, it's up to you. It's, but I pretty much do uh, two or three, three, three fourths of a cup of uh, measuring inside here, and I mix it all together. And then in the, with the heat, it makes it stick together, and it comes out really good. So we're gonna dump it in here. And then we pour it in. I'm gonna do start off with two right now. And you can already taste, you can already smell the salt in it. So then we're gonna get more scoops and then shake it in. some more kettle. Here is a, it's a gold medal uh, flavoring. Um, you can get a lot of different options. You can go firehouse pantry. There's also um, uh, spice barn and uh, all of them are great. I like the gold medal ones and the firehouse pantry the best. This is about $35 for gold medal. If you can get it on Qatar, maybe for a little bit less. And it goes a long way. I plan on eventually ordering bulk to save a little bit more money. But this is Schmitty's Kettle Core guys. Thanks for liking and subscribing on YouTube. If any more questions or any more video interest, feel free to uh, ask below. And uh, thanks for hearing from me from the comments and um, thanks for following guys.